Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy that you wanted to... You know the feeling where you just can't say ordinary sentences? That is sort of my day, I think. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy that you wanted to join me today because today I am going to go thrifting. I put out a feeler yesterday on Instagram asking you guys whether or not you wanted to see a thrift haul. I recently put up a thrift haul on this channel as well, but you guys always seem really keen to go thrifting, which I love. I am there for it. I've been cheating a little bit because I have already been out. I was out a couple of days ago where I had something put aside. So I'm going to go and pick that up. It's kind of a big thing. Um, and the last time I was in the thrift shop, I was on my bike, so I couldn't really bring it. So I will need to take it home with me in the bus. So that's going to be interesting. Most importantly, this is about consuming consciously, which means that don't go on shopping sprees in fast fashion stores if you don't really need anything you feel. So it's all this unnecessary stuff because most of the consumption of textiles today is based not on a need but on a demand that is based on feelings and just, I mean, I kind of want something for spring, that sort of thing. And that's not necessarily super, super important, but that's something we have been accustomed to believe that it's okay. So, wow. Let's go and do this. I am not wearing any makeup, as you may can tell, but it's okay. I don't really feel like it today. So yeah, that's enough rambling. Let's go thrifting. Okay, so it is a different day. So I'd like to say firstly that I went out thrifting without a canvas bag and I'm pretty sure that's one of the deadly sins. Um, so I asked the, the cashier lady if they had a paper bag and she started pulling out all of these plastic bags and said, oh, no, it, it has to be paper. And she said, oh, is that like, like an eco thing? Yeah, yeah. You can say it's an eco thing. Are you ready to see the one I got? Yeehaw! Okay, so I went to... This is from four thrift shops, actually, in general, I think. I just accumulated a bit of stuff over the last two weeks, so... Let's do this. Uh, firstly, this is something that I'm the most excited about, because I just love buying something to hang on my walls. I love the aesthetic of just completely filled up wall space with tons and tons of different pictures. I love that idea. Um, and I'm not really a poster kind of person. I love my art to be unique and original and stuff. Um, but sometimes I find a poster that is just so damn gorgeous that I need to have it. And I found two the other day. Um, so the first one, I'll just show you right now. The first one is a moth. This frame is a little bit, I mean, just it's not very sturdy, but it's, it's cool. I found a moth and I really, really enjoy the simplicity of it. And then I found 
this with a like botanic drawing of a plant and I love it. Um, so yeah, I got these two and I need to hang them in my restroom because I don't really have any decoration in there and I thought it would brighten up the space a little bit. So I bought these two and I really, really enjoy them and I love just all wooden frames like this. I think that's one of the best things ever. And then I have a few random finds in here as well. It's all good. Then I just I was just browsing a thrift store waiting for the main thrift store to open Yafil and I found a book about the Medici family and uh, I love me some art, especially Italian art. I think it's absolutely amazing and I love the literature and the history. Um, okay, one piece of clothing. Ta -da -da -da. I don't know what happened. I'm just not very... I'm, I, I don't really need any more clothes and I always have this. It needs to be specifically what I have been wanting in my dreams for ages. Otherwise, I won't buy it. That's just my opinion now. But I have been looking for a black denim skirt for just years and years and it needed to be short but not too short and long but not too long, just anything. And this, okay, it looks very very short, I promise you it, it's also very very short but I, I do enjoy it and wearing tight with it is not going to be that bad. But I really really wanted a black denim skirt because I do have a blue denim skirt and I, I just really want this black one and this is great and I can distress this a little bit and look super edgy, it's going to be amazing. So I'm happy, <laughs> that was perfect for me. Okay, so we have some kitchen supplies as well. I got a big ass bowl. I love this kind of bowl so, so much. I had the smaller ones and they're just really, really good for cooking and I use this for salads and dough making and soups and I made this big pile of ramen the other day and it's just a bowl that matches my ambition with the food. I think it's absolutely perfect. So, so happy that I got this. This is also maybe a little bit basic. I love this woman. I have seen several places where people have vases or pots that shaped like uh, Greek sculptures and then you can put stuff in their heads and it looks really cool. Supreme Banana has one and I just absolutely love it and it's so cool. Um, so I was really excited that I found this one. Um, so right now she has this very, very tall little plant and possibly there's going to be some succulents in it instead that's going to look a lot better. But I just really, really love the look of this. It's in my window and yeah, girl is a happy plant mama today. Definitely and proud and proud. Small seeds, big trees. <laughs> oh, I'm in a good mood today, but the weather is also just absolutely magnificent. Last thing, the big thing, not going to pull it in this frame. I'm going to insert some pictures because that's going to be so much easier. I got a ladder and, um, and I love it. I'm going to hang my clothes on there and it's going to look so much better and I'm already using it. And okay, right now it's a little bit messy, but when the pictures that you are seeing are much more aesthetically pleasing because I styled it. But I think that's a really, really nice option for me. It also forces me to, to clean up and tidy up a little bit more. And I need that sometimes, really, I do. And I got the ladder on a Friday and then over the weekend I couldn't pick it up. So I went and picked it up on Monday and I had it with me in the bus and it was great. Um, but I love, 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 love my new ladder and I think it's so cool. I really, I'm, I'm working towards a wider bedroom and then I have all my just my brown and grey shades and, and darker shades in my living room but I love this light feeling that there is in the bedroom that everything is just very fresh and light and yeah, it gives me so much joy. So yeah, those were the things that I found in the thrift shop. I hope that you enjoyed this. If you have any really cool thrift finds then talk to me about it. Tell me down below, I would love to know. Thank you so much for sticking with me and I hope that this made any sense. Anyway, take really good care of yourselves and see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching this video and also a special thank you to my Patreon supporters. You guys help me create green zero waste contents and I love you guys. You can find the links to my social media accounts down below and the link to my Patreon on this screen. Bye!